Let me use All right, perfect. He's a great question. Also, he's doing a Shout out to my future subscriber, Kevin. Thank you so much for subscribing. Hi guys, and welcome back to the channel. Today I have a very, very, very special guest. It's my brother! Hello <laughs> so, guys. <laughs> so we are gonna be doing the sibling tag where you guys will get to learn more about my brother and I and like our relationship. And we're also gonna do a collaboration where we'll be reviewing some Oreos. It's not just any type of Oreos. I know my brother's excited to tell you guys about it. These are the original Oreos that I'm like really excited about because you know I love Oreos. But there's a special type of Oreos that my brother brought that I can't wait for us to try. So do you want to tell the people more about this? Yes. Hi guys. Um, so as we all know, Supreme just had Big Five last week Thursday, and um, they released uh, the Oreo cookies. Um, the cookies are actually going for twenty to thirty bucks. <laughs> For a pack. Um, I already sold a few. And this cost me about three dollars. <laughs> okay. And, and this then, cost me three dollars also. Right? And then this. It's not bad. Yeah, also about three dollars. So there's three cookies in here, people. There's well, three in here. Simply get into the video, we're gonna have a comparison of uh, Supreme Oreo cookies versus uh, the traditional or uh, regular Oreo cookies. The first question is who is older? So. Okay. Well, I am older, guys. Um, <laughs> Who has the best hair? Um, I think I have the best hair. Like, my hair is curlier, like, whenever I wash it and stuff. <laughs> I don't if know. You say so. His hair is a little seedy. <laughs> I don't know. I think I have the best hair. What do you think? I don't know. I can't, I can't my see. My curls are popping, okay? When on nice, on good days, my curls are popping. Um, who has the best sense of style? Definitely me. You know? <laughs> Definitely me. Completely biased. <laughs> Who has the biggest appetite? Yeah, I don't, I don't think anyone wins that. <laughs> Nobody wins that. We both have horrible appetites. <laughs> we both take forever to eat our food, so um, yeah. <laughs> so no that's why this video is probably going to be a fail, because it's going to take me like five minutes. Now nah, I'm exaggerating, but like, imagine five minutes to eat one cookie. <laughs> <laughs> so what is the age gap between you? So... Well, I'm one year and maybe five months. I think okay. six months. Let me see. Something like that. Yeah, it's one year, five months ish. Because you're August. August yeah, yeah. And March. Yeah. So. Yep. So when he was one year and five months old, I was born. And he's the 13th, I'm the 14th. So we're like, very close. If you were born first, what was your reaction to your new sibling? <laughs> well, I mean, I was born, born first, but I mean, I can't say um, what my reaction was because I was only one year and a half. So I, there's really no telling what my reaction was. I, I can't recall what my reaction was. <laughs> you should ask Maybe I cried, maybe I laughed, who knows. Um, but there's really no telling. So. How do you feel now knowing that you're not the only child though? I don't feel any type of way. I mean, it's, 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 it's good to have a sibling, especially of the opposite, rather than the similar gender, because then you know, it's much more competitive. Well, we gotta fight over clothes and shoes and... Yeah. Did you get along as children? <laughs> I mean... For the most part. Yeah. Like, I think we got along like any normal sibling. Like, we of course fought and argued and it, it got wild, but... I, I would say we got along. It wasn't... <laughs> yeah. It wasn't like anything... Like, out of the ordinary as to like, we hated each other. It was just like, regular... Like, I don't know. Yeah, it was yeah. just competitive. That's. That but now nah, you could have messed with my brother though. Like I was that. <laughs> you could have messed with him, all right? Yo, there's. I don't know if they're gonna ask for that story, but maybe I'll tell you guys the story later. All right. Childhood memory of your sibling. Yes, childhood memory. Hmm. Good question. Um. Oh, when you oh, were. <laughs> I don't do that. You know? Oh no! Is it gonna be embarrassing? I don't know. Probably. I don't know. <laughs> it was um, it was when you raced, when you when you <laughs> raced, and you came third place. <laughs> I think I remember you wearing a yellow outfit or something, and you were running on the track. <laughs> the picture's in my mind. And then we have that picture at home. 
but yeah, I, that's all I remember. I remember you just came. Oh my gosh, I remember details dirty, that's all from I remember. that race. Yeah. Wait, yeah, that was when I was in was that kindergarten or first? That was definitely like nursery school days. I think it was kindergarten. <laughs> that was my first race ever, and I didn't remember. Like, it's, I didn't, not that I didn't remember. I didn't really understand the rules of a race, <laughs> so I was in first place at first. But then I think I was like so excited because I saw my mom or I saw someone and I was like, hi, like Barbie or whatever. And my mom was like, keep going, keep going. So then, <laughs> then one of the other girls like passed me, she's like, keep going. And by the time I realized it was like, I was already so close to the finish line that like the reason that I stopped, I don't know or understand. But yeah, I got third place, which is not bad. Like I got my award and stuff, which is great, but like I, I would have won that race. But I was gonna say, my favorite memory of you was when you did the um, the play in sixth grade. Remember when you did Joseph and the Technicolor Ring? Oh, yeah, I remember that. Oh, what do you mean in PS9? Right? Yeah, the, okay, don't tell them in school. Please. But yeah, um, when he was in elementary school, and he did like such a great job. Like the whole play was so well put together, and yeah. Well, you remember that one. Of course I remember that. <laughs> it was like 10, what? No, more than 10 years Even ago. like now, when I talk about Joseph and the second color raincoat, like with my kids in Sunday school, like that's the image I have in my mind because like I saw it for the first time like come to fruition and I was only in like fifth grade. So like, yeah, I learned a lot from that play and it was really good. Like they were so talented, everyone that sang, everyone that danced, like an off-Broadway production. Like it yeah. was good enough. Yeah, that was my first Broadway production, if if you want to say. <laughs> um, oh, Broadway, but yeah, it was it was really good. It was really good. So I was like, "That's my brother, that's my brother." Mm -hmm, the funniest memory. <laughs> well, I guess losing that race. Yeah, that could be one. What did you fight most about as children? The remote. <laughs> yeah. Was, like what show to watch? Yeah, it was it was also attention too. Like for example, um, I guess. When it came to report cards, oh. whoever had the higher grade, they felt that they were entitled to get what they wanted. So, and they would say, hey mom, I did better than Renata. Like, hey, I deserve, you know. They being you. <laughs> Duh. You just told on yourself. But yeah, definitely, yeah, with grades too, we definitely competed. Hmm. What is the last text you sent your sibling? He probably texted me like he's outside or open or something. Yeah. I don't know who's calling me. That was probably the last communication we had. Um, are you closer now or when you were younger? Um, well, I mean, I would say that maybe you were not... Well, now we live in separate locations, so um, if that makes sense in terms of closer. Um, so, I mean, there's still interaction, but it's not maybe as often. So, but yeah, there's still interaction. We're still close. It's just that maybe we're not as closer as we were when we were younger. Mm -hmm. I don't know, maybe that. I don't know, it's kind of hard. I feel like now it's a balance. Like, now we're adults and we're like living our lives and stuff. And like he said, we don't live in the same like house. But I feel like I can pick up the phone and call my brother and call him if I need to. But it's not to the point where it's like we're tired of seeing each other every single day and we're arguing about the same stuff. But like, now I feel like we talk more. Like, we actually have conversations versus like making fun of each other, <laughs> like arguing. like. Yeah, now we actually have like built that relationship. I feel like so it's good. Ah, it's gonna get cheesy. Do you get along with your siblings' friends? Yeah. Yeah. I don't yeah. have any problems with your friends. Yeah. I don't, really, I don't really know. I don't really have problems with a lot of you. But I don't really know a lot of your friends. With you, so. Yeah. It's like. What? But the ones he's met, they're cool. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, for the, most part. Yeah. the ones he's met for the most part are around still, so he's met. There's one thing your sibling can do, but you can't do. Yeah. I know this. I can write on my left hand, she can't. Because I'm left handed, so yeah. <laughs> for real. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Here's your trophy! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> you get a cookie. Yes, enjoy that cookie because I don't want it. <laughs> Who's the most attractive? You guys decide. <laughs> I like took off my wing and everything. All natural. I'm cutting this part out. I'm cutting it out. Who is the most talented? Um, 
I'm artistic. I do photography a bit on the side. Oh wow, I'm like hyping myself up. But no, my brother's also very talented too. Like he yeah. is a great teacher. He's good with math. Very good. He's good with technology. Um I just want to do this. Nah, we're we're, we're both talented. Let's just yeah, keep it that. Best singing voice. Yeah. I guess I'll give that to you because you have <laughs> You your... guess. I guess I mean hey, <laughs> You guess. I surrender that show for you. So. I surrender all. <laughs> Sounds like we lost the battle. <laughs> wow. Wow. That's how you feel though. What's your favorite game to play together? Oh, as of late, I would say dominoes. Dominoes! Yeah. <laughs> dominoes, dominoes. Yeah, that's I usually win. So, um, well, nah, that's not necessarily. I usually win. It's also how trash. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, if you look at most great competitors in the world, they all talk trash. Michael Jordan talked trash. Kobe Bryant talked trash. Uh, yeah, but they also won. Yeah, it's I, not I the same. Yeah, I <laughs> not too, the yes. same. All right, guys, we could go on for hours like this back and forth thing, but um, do we have nicknames for each other? Not to my name. I don't know. I call him Ron. Yeah, I don't have a nickname for you. you know? Yeah, like I have a family nickname, but he doesn't call me that. He like actually calls me by my full name. <laughs> Most talkative. He can be very talkative. I get talkative when. And only when I'm excited about what I'm talking about. Or if I'm very knowledgeable about what I'm talking about. That's it. Which, I mean, he's usually very excited about stuff. <laughs> so, <laughs> that answers your question. Who takes longer to get ready in the morning? <laughs> There's that one time that he took like forever and I was so upset because I was like, this shouldn't be happening. I'm usually the one that you, like, I'm usually the one taking long and you're usually waiting on me. But then the one time I had to wait on him, I was so annoyed. I was like, all right, I, I see what you've been going through. But yeah, I usually take forever to get ready. If you got called that your sibling was in jail, what would be the first crime that comes to mind? No. Honestly. <laughs> I think, and God forbid, like this is not like even funny, it kind of happens to like our young men out there. He would be arrested for a crime that he has no idea about. Like, what are you talking about? Like, and the thing is, like, he's so innocent that he's still like very innocent. Like, my brother wouldn't hurt a fly. It's like, yeah, I don't know. I don't think he would. God forbid, because you know what's going on in our world and things that have been happening with our young black men, you know, I always pray that like that never happens to anyone close to me or just that it stops in general because even if it's not someone that's close to you, it's still impacting our world today and our society. So True. that's actually a really good question. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So I think that's it. I think we got our video. Yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed our review on the Supreme versus the original Oreos. And then you also got to learn more about my sibling. Did you say your name? You said your name, right? In the beginning? I think I did, Rundell. My Rundell. name is Rundell, guys. Um, Renata and Rundell. Rundell and Renata. Yeah, it's, My parents are corny. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a thing with parents. They like to name their siblings, I mean their kids, with uh, the same letter. <laughs> I don't know why. But <laughs> we literally have the same initials. Yeah. Like, first name, middle name, last name. Yeah. We could be twins. So. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a like, a thumbs up to show us that you guys enjoyed it. Also comment below like if there was something funny, something that you can relate to, um, or any questions you have for myself or my brother that joined us on the channel. Um, you guys got to know a little bit more about us and then also got to see like whether or not we're team original or team Supremes. You guys already know where I stand. But you know my, um, my sign off? No, not fully. <laughs> Be blessed, spread love, and stay beautiful inside and out. Wait, say it again? Be, two, one. Be, Be blessed, blessed, spread, spread love, love, and stay, stay beautiful, beautiful inside and out. Bye, guys! You can turn it this way if you want. <laughs>